Hi everyone, I'm back for another video and today I'm doing it on a 2021 Ford Escape SE. This SE has all wheel drive and the convenience package on it as well, which is a new package for 2021. All right, so as you see, this one's more of a standard vehicle. Something for somebody who doesn't need a lot of features, someone who doesn't care for a lot of features at all, honestly. You still get a bang for your buck though. This one has pre-collision with automatic emergency braking, so you get the camera on the windshield for that. You're also gonna get blind spot monitors in the mirrors, a rear camera, cross traffic alert, all those safety features. This one's gonna be equipped with a 1.5 liter three cylinder turbo. Gonna give you 181 horsepower, 190 foot pound feet of torque. So for being a small engine, honestly, it's plenty of power. Of course it is uh, plenty enough power for a vehicle this size is only 3,400 pounds. All right, this one's gonna get 26 in the city, 31 on the highway and 28 combined per miles per gallon. Coming around to the back, this one has a power lift gate, which comes in that convenience package. In the convenience package, there's also a leather wrapped steering wheel and dual zone climate control. Also a 10 way power driver's seat. As you see, the seats are down, so you get plenty of room with the seats down. And if I were to put the seats up, you get plenty of room with the seats up as well. So we've got some floor mats. And then down here, you get some storage. This one here does not have the option where you add the 17 inch spare. This one just has the regular air compressor with the uh, tire sealant. But you can get a mini spare if you wanted to. This one does not. <laughs> All right, and I can just close that right here. Taking a look at the back seat. It's really cool in the back seat of the Escape because it looks really small on the outside, but for some reason on the inside, it's really big. So I love to show people the features where the back seat actually slides forward and backward. Also tilts. So if you were at the standard back length, then you can actually go all the way back too. So you can recline it as well. And then back here in the SE, you're gonna get some plugs for your rear passengers. You're also gonna get some cup holders in the center. And you're also gonna get some vents for the rear passenger as well. This one actually is gonna have the eight inch touchscreen. This one does not have navigation, but you do have the option to add navigation. But you do get Apple CarPlay and Android Auto when you connect in through USB. This has the USB port and the USB-C port down here. Also has a cigarette lighter, 12 volt. And then you're gonna get the dual climate, like I said, in the convenience package. So each person can select their temperature and auto climate as well. And then over here, you're gonna get a standard instrument cluster with a little screen for information about the vehicle, your phone settings, your music. This is your driver assist. So if you were to put your cruise control on, you can basically just have that and look all the seat features there with the lane keeping assist system. So I can turn that on and off over here is the stock. And it shows you the lines up there. And then you get your favorites view. So this one's got some miles per gallon and the music showing, but you can change all that as well. And then my favorite one, and cause I own a Ford myself, but my favorite one is actually this screen. So you can see um, all that information there. It's your trip. Okay. And then this one has automatic windows as well. So you can go automatic down and up for the driver window. And then you get some power folding mirrors for the let me try that again. Ready? This one has auto driver's window, so you get to put that down, and then it's regular manual up. It's got some power mirrors, so you can adjust the mirrors. And then on the side over here, where the headlight adjustment is over here, I don't know if you can see that. Can you see it? Yeah, yeah. All right, so the adjustment over here, you actually get a button for the tailgate, so I can open up the tailgate for someone if they're in the back. Also get the automatic headlights and the control for the instrument cluster as well. And I can also close the back trunk as well. And then coming down here to the gear selector, you get a rotary shift knob here. 
so I can just select what gear I want. And this one has the eight speed transmission, which is the reason why we get such good gas mileage here. This one combined is getting 31.7 miles per gallon, it says up here. So it's getting better than the window sticker says. So every situation is different. And then my favorite feature is actually how we're in drive right now and I can let go of the brake. And the reason being is because down here by the shifter, you get the auto brake hold so you can turn that on. Right now it's set to on. So if you were to have it off, you can just set it on. And then you also are gonna get the drive mode. So down by that button as well, there's a drive mode button in which you can actually see up here, you can change the mode. So from normal to eco, sport, slippery, deep snow and sand in the SE. Thank you so much for tuning in to our YouTube channel to see this SE Escape 2021. You guys have a great day.